Okay, everyone. I excuse myself if the camera is a little tilted. I have to figure out how to get this new camera uh, fixed on my stand correctly. Because it is a little... It's not completely horizontal. It's tilted a little. Okay, this is a little... Oh, and you went to sleep mode again. Uh, it's a little update video. My monthly update. This is supposed to be. Um, first of all, yeah, you're noticing I'm looking here to the side. My laptop is standing here. Uh, what? Wrong password. Oh. Okay. First of all, I want to thank all my patrons. All of you. The reason I have my laptop here is because... I have to read your names. And your names are... Sorry if I butcher some of them. Xcoda, Pyrodroids, Icy Shake, Tuan Nguyen, Heartless Tales, Joseph Tanner, Ludwin, Comic Sans Pony... By the way, dude, I watched your channel. Interesting. Rob Johnson, Johnston, sorry, Rob Johnston, The Mighty Anon, Xenofera, by the way, dude, I still would like to know where you got your avatar made, because that anime style pony really looks great. Simon Parak, may the dark side be with you. And Xerxes, because bad ponies. Okay, let's begin. Uh, there's not much to say about this month, actually. What happened last month, you guys basically know. I had to, like, put my updates basically on a hiatus because of the hospital uh, stay because of my arm. Uh, I apologize if I wear this crappy jacket, but it's the only thing I can comfortably put on. Getting into a t-shirt is a bit of a problem if you're not able to raise your arm. I can, like, do this movement again, but uh, I'm not allowed to raise it like this, because it might dislocate again, until it's fully healed and I have my first therapy session tomorrow. Um, yeah. Next thing is, one of my friends contacted me lately, and this is not a... You could say a uh, regular thing, but she did Project Horizons Chapter 26 for you guys. Basically, I narrated it and she edited it. Um, she doesn't want to be credited because she doesn't want to be associated with My Little Pony, which I can totally understand. But let's just thank her. She's the same one, by the way, who made that animation for me that once, just so you have a reference. Um, some of you might know that in August I will be attending Galacon. So for everyone who's there, you come, come forth, address me or approach me. We can sit down, have a coffee or something. And I've had something made for that special occasion, which is this. Can you see it? With my name on it and my OC. That OC picture actually I took from another piece of fan art one of you sent me. I think it was you, Montel. Um, yeah, with me and Lost on there. So I just took my head out of there, uh, put two microphones in the background and had it printed on a, on a shirt. But yeah, I like it, so uh, you can recognize me but since I'll be wearing that shirt. I doubt anyone else will wear such, such a shirt. Um, yeah, so basically this Saturday, 
Fall Equestria Project Horizons Chapter 26 will be out. You can thank my friend for that. Basically she kinda hates me right now because of uh, my instructions. Yeah, she put a little bit of a personal touch in there, so I will not take any responsibility for her music choice because I sent her my stuff, <coughs> my music folder, my sound effects folder and my project files. And I tried to like direct her over um, Skype screen, screen share. She totally ignored me sometimes. So as I said, I'm not taking any responsibility for her music choice. <coughs> uh, and if I say she hates me, no. She's just a little annoyed. As soon as she didn't sing, I was like, yeah, she was asking how I was and I was like, yeah, everything's okay so far but I can't edit my videos right now and she was like hey yeah I watch your videos and can I help and I was like joking saying if you want you could like edit one of my recordings and she agreed she didn't know what she got herself into so not my fault <laughs> so um, another thing I wanted to show you I think I've showed shown you my uh, old laptop was an Asus KJ52E model. I'll try to put a picture in here. I don't have it anymore, but Google. Uh, so, what I have now is a little bigger. I would have shown it to you guys earlier. It would have been better because I would have had two arms and that thing is pretty heavy. Let's see if I can get it into the viewfinder. There it is. Yeah. A 17.3 inch laptop with a steel case. It's heavy, I can tell you. And even though it looks good and has a very good performance, very good, very good really, I can tell you one thing. You will see every friggin fingerprint on it. There, this thing comes actually with a screen wiper. I use it 90% of the time just to wipe the metal. The metal parts on here. Because it's so, it gets dirty so easily. And that I'm living in an old house, which is kind of prone to be dusty, uh, doesn't really help. Another news. I upgraded this baby with an SSD, with a, which I didn't know I needed an M mini SSD. Uh, hard drive, so it was good that the retailer exchanged it for a mini SATA. So basically, I have so freaking storage space right now. Never had this much on a computer before. I'll, I'm honest with you, I never had this much storage space, but I actually need that much. Because I have start, I, I had this little discussion with my father about audio quality, and he was like, "Why don't you save your projects in WAV?" I was like, "WLV WAV files are freaking huge." But then he explained to me some things like. Uh, that okay yes a WAV file is huge but it it is uncompressed so therefore the quality is better at least that's what he says so yeah can you imagine how big one chapter 
unedited. There are no sound effects in it yet. Uh, of Fallout Quest where Project Horizons is. Because I've actually recorded this thing up to chapter 28. Just with this arm I cannot uh, I cannot edit. I can record with one hand because the new version of Order City actually has this uh, delete option. In the old version which I used, there was uh, you had to um, edit um, audio and then I think one or two different sub menus and then there was the delete option. Now in the new version you just click edit and there is the delete option. Because when I record, as you can see in the live reading of Asylum chapter 26 that I did, um, when I make a mistake, I stop the recording, go back, delete the parts where I, where I messed up, and re-record and re them. Uh, yeah, I don't know if this camera will pick it up actually. I'll put a screenshot in here. Here. Here, because let's see, two gigabytes. Chapter twenty-seven is two gigabytes in WAV files. For my archive, they are then later converted to MP3, which is much smaller. But I uh, recently took to um, making three hundred twenty kilobyte MP3s out of them, and they are still huge, like three hundred megabytes. Uh, something up. Shouldn't try to use that arm to push myself up. But you know, it's kind of like an instinct when you move. So yeah. Someone wants something from me on Skype? Ah, oh, no, it's just a group chat. Uh, so. Now you basically know what's going on. I have... Uh, up to chapter 28 of Project Horizons recorded. I Right now the auditions for Project Horizons are not going well. I have only a few voices have been sent to me. And let's be honest, let's be honest. There is a spoiler now, or two spoilers. So if you don't want to be spoiled after Project Horizons, stop the video. You've had your chance. I'm saying it now. In one of the later chapters, I think it was chapter 32 or 34, not quite sure, Blackjack gets raped. This is a scene that uh, I can imagine uh, deterred many narrators. It was certainly a point for me why I didn't want to do this. But um, I said, okay, I've done club before, and this scene is not very short. It's quite detailed. So, uh, yeah. There will be an age limit on that video. I never did, did that before, but there will be an age limit on this video. Once I get to it. I could have excused this because it's fiction. But the latest chapter of Project Horizons I didn't even finish. I didn't finish to read it. It's chapter 75, part B. It's like uh, Somber is uh, trying to deter people to narrate his story. I have one golden rule, and that is that I will not do foal con. And on the latest chapter of Project Horizons, I was really looking forward to that chapter. I didn't read it. There's one warning at the beginning that uh, there is a scene with consensual sex between a minor and an adult. So basically, foal con. I don't do Falcon. Doesn't mean that I will stop doing Project Horizons, but I'll tell you right now that I will not read that scene. I will. I, I'm usually not censoring. You, you can see that on my channel. I've done 
club before, I've done horrible stuff before. But that scene, I will edit out once I get to it. I will not do it. Uh uh. No fucking way. Usually I'm not censoring, but I think you cannot blame me. This is against my policy. Some of you have actually tried to get me to read full call in the past. And those of you can remember that I do absolutely not do it. Some of you have po some of those who have spoken to me have pointed out like Luna the Matchmaker where uh, I think AJ's kid and Rainbow Dash's kid were getting together. That was something different. They were like teenagers of like 16, 17. Is that something different? Scotch tape is like nine. That is not going to go on my channel. Sorry, guys. I will read the chapter, but without that scene. This is a long way to come. It's like 75 part two, but I will not do that. Understand? I will not do that, and I think you can't blame me for that. I do not endorse or uh, support full porn or you know what that stands for right so without further ado i am visual pony and hopefully see you soon